Hello everyone, my name is Chris and welcome to the channel. In this video we are going to take a look on how you can block ads uh, on Microsoft Edge browser. So we want to install uh, an extension that can help us um, browse with, with uh, a few ads as possible and also maybe uh, block some, some ads uh, from, uh, from uh, YouTube. Uh, but before we jump into that one, a quick word from our uh, sponsor today, CloudSwap. CloudSwap is a service that helps you copy files from uh, one cloud provider to another. So let's get uh, into that segment and talk to you in a bit. And today's video is sponsored by CloudSwap. CloudSwap is an online service tool that can help you transfer files from one cloud provider to another. For example, if you have um, your files hosted on OneDrive and you wish to switch to Google Drive, that's no problem. It's all done in three easy steps. You need to select the folders and files that you wish to transfer and then choose the destination where you want them to be copied. And that's it. You simply click start and then your files will be copied to the new cloud provider. Uh, for more information, please check the link in the description below and uh, register for free and start uh, migrating your, or transferring your files. Cool. Okay, so let's get started installing an ad blocker on Microsoft Edge browser. First thing first, we have to open Edge, of course. So open your Edge browser. And what I want you to do is go ahead on this, uh, click on this free dotted menu here on the top right hand side and look for extensions and we have the extensions um, option here click on it now this um, page shows you all the extensions that you have currently uh, installed on, the, on on this uh, on your browser i have none so what i want to do is click on get extension from microsoft page click on this blue button here and you'll get redirected to uh, Microsoft edge.microsoft.com slash add-ons page where you can look um, to all the extensions that um, um, we have of, uh, the, uh, all the extensions that are available for the Edge browser. Now, of course, I have some most popular here, but for the sake of this example, because I want to show you how you can search for other extensions as well, I will go ahead and search for maybe free ad blocker and click enter and you will get a list of 326 extensions that matches uh, match uh, matches this uh, these keywords that i added here and of course you can can look through it uh, one thing i want you to pay attention is maybe the rating it's it's important of course right for example this one has a five out of five stars rating but also and also nine uh, rating uh, nine uh, ratings there you go but i also want you to look at this number here so 1000 plus users are using this um this extension now the, the extension that i'm i'm gonna recommend today there's no affiliation to, to this uh, extension i just personally use it i find it to be one of the best lightweight and uh, it works like a charm i've been using it for more than five years now and i use it on all my browsers it's called, uh, let me see if I can see it in the list. There you go, ad blocker plus, in this case, free ad blocker. So let's click on it. You see here almost five stars from 643 uh, reviews and almost uh, f more than 5 million users are using this actually. Perfect. In order for you to add the extension to Microsoft Edge, uh, click on Get, this Get button here, and you'll get a pop-up with a few things that uh, you have to pay attention to. So, Edge is mentioning that by adding this uh, ad blocker extension, this extension can read and change all your data on the website you visit or display notifications. Now. In order for an extension, and this is not only for this specific extension, but in order for extension to block the, the, the ads, um, they have to crawl through the, the website that you, you are uh, browsing in order to determine 
if uh, there are some trackers on it if uh, there are some pop-ups if uh, there is an ad um, so they can differentiate from the content that uh, you have to watch and also the um, and, and the ads that they have to block right so uh, I'm gonna click on yes I understand this and I'm gonna add extension I'm gonna add this extension and you can see here the extensions the extension was added to there you go that's the icon and now ad blocker is being installed cool they also have like a honor system an honor system and you can donate to the developers to keep maintaining the um, the extensions if you if you wish if you enjoy this um so let's go ahead and test it so i'm gonna just i don't know go ahead and uh, maybe open cnn that's a popular uh, website Perfect. So as you can see here, top right um, on the top bar uh, of the extension, you have uh, the number four here. And if you click on, the, on on the icon here, it will show you that, hey, we blocked four ads or items uh, on this page. And that's really cool. Uh, you, you will see <laughs> you will see numbers with uh, double digit um, we see websites, sorry, with double digit uh, numbers here that have a lot of trackers. Um, and uh, yeah, I, uh, I encourage you to keep an eye on uh, your favorite websites and how many things um, they have uh, behind the scenes. Let's, let's put it like that. Now, uh, there are some websites that have a um, detection system for ad blockers and they will not let you um, uh, see the, the content until you disable the, uh, the ad blocker and if you wish to do that it, that's very simple with this extension just toggle this button here and just refresh the page and as you can see now the extension is grayed out and you will see all the the ads um, on, on the specific website uh, if you want to toggle it again click again click refresh and you're good to go so if you find this uh, useful please make sure you give me a thumbs up that really helps uh, this video and the overall channel if you like the, the the content on this channel with this type of tips and tricks on anything related to it please make sure you you subscribe and thank you again for watching and talk to you in the next one bye